Hello, I'm so glad you came to visit. My name is Valerie Sutton, and my name sign, my name sign in sign language, is Valerie. V-A-L-E-R-I-E-S-U-T-T-O-N. Yeah, this is California. And I want you to know that I'm very excited because there's a group in French Switzerland that is using sign writing. And their organization is called Sign Écriture. I hope I said that correctly in French, which means sign writing. Sign writing is a way to read and write sign language, any sign language in the world, because sign writing writes body movement. It, it writes the way we move. So you can apply it to writing any sign language in the world. And in French Switzerland, they have their unique French Swiss sign language, which has been written in sign writing for decades. Well, the organization Sign Écriture is, I think, at least a decade old. And they just had a celebration, a celebration. On November 18th, 2017, I received an announcement. Well, they actually had the celebration on November 18th, 2017. See, this is the flyer, and it says it right there. Mm -hmm. See how it says November 18th, 2017? And here, isn't that a beautiful flyer? And there are signs written in sign writing on the background of this flyer. And it tells about the celebration they're going to have. Well, they've already had it technically because I'm making this video on the 21st of November, a couple of days later. I want you all to know that I was with you in spirit. Thank you for telling me about your beautiful event and I appreciate the personal card that you sent me. And I got such an exciting feeling when I opened your box. This is the gorgeous box that I received from French Switzerland. Isn't that beautiful? Thank you. What I really loved was on the outside of the package, for the post office sake, <laughs> they have the label, Association Sign Écriture. So it's even written in sign writing there. That's the sign for the organization. Thank you. And then when I opened it up, I got so excited. Oh, boy. And there were a bunch of cards in here. See? Can you see that? And inside the cards, well, they're different colors. Have you noticed? See, I'll put it back here so you can see it. We have orange, and then we have purple. So what is the difference? Well, I'm curious myself. So first of all, I looked at the orange. And just so you know, the orange, every single card has the same signature of signed écriture on them. But then when you turn them over, see? Wow, isn't this beautiful? They have pictures of things, and then they have the signs, if I can get this so you can see it, everybody, there we go. They have signs written in sign writing showing the vocabulary, essentially. This is like a vocabulary playing cards, I believe. And it shows the symbols that are used to write these uh, signs. For example, I just took this one off, and now I go to the next one, and look at that. We've got a, a really nice doctor, and there's the sign for doctor written right next to, to the picture. Let me see if I can show you here. That's the picture of doctor, but over there, that's the sign for doctor in French Switzerland. And you can see the symbols are down here underneath, showing you what those symbols look like, and you can figure out which one you're going to use when you write the sign. And above up here are other signs written using those symbols. It's really well done. This is a, an excellent teaching tool. I am really impressed. And look at this, and here's multiple vocabulary explaining, you know, other signs that use those symbols. And I suspect this is a game. And the reason I'm telling you that is, first of all, their little note to me said there was a game in the box. And the, hey, you know, I had one up on that one. <laughs> but if you take a look at the purple, I love the color, by the way. <laughs> I've always been a purple person. Um, look at that. See the, the instructions for a game? It says, it's a little small for you to see in a video, but it says sign match six. And then it explains what you're supposed to do for the, for the game. So this is a card game. And see they have cards that have different, um, you know, written French Swiss signs on them in sign writing. And then I guess you play cards like that, right? 
And of course, you're going to have to teach me how you do it. I don't know. Maybe these, I have to read the instruction. <laughs> these work with the orange, I bet, and give you vocabulary education while you're playing a game. Isn't that gorgeous? Just think of all the work that they went to in French Switzerland to create this gorgeous box just for me and also for all the people in French Switzerland who use sign language and who write their sign language. Which brings up something you may not realize. Sign languages are becoming written languages and a lot of people don't know that. But you can write sign languages and there isn't just one sign language. It's not an international language. There are different sign languages in not only in every country, but oftentimes several different versions or dialects of a language can be within one country. So I guess you could say that sign languages are unique languages developed by the people who use them every day. And here in the United States, we're kind of isolated from the people in French Switzerland, so we don't know how they sign in French Switzerland, but with sign writing, we have a way to write the way the body moves, and we can write that on, on cards, and it gives us a way to communicate. So now I can learn some French Swiss signs. Here's, it looks like television, and I can learn that sign now, and if I were to meet somebody from French Switzerland, I can show them the card and say, see, I know how to sign that. <laughs> so thank you very much. And I want to thank Sign Ecriture for all of the hard work you continue to do. And thank you again for telling me about your event and sending me the box. Many blessings from, from me. Bye-bye.